Welcome everybody, this is your boy Dread of Montano, and we here with another Grand Theft Auto V PC modding tutorials. Like always, if you like this video, smash that like button. And if you're new here, subscribe for more daily gaming content. And we're going to get straight into the video. Welcome back guys, this video is all about on how to install your gun running business mod inside your Grand Theft Audio V folder. So like always make sure you download all of the requirements that's inside my description below and make sure that your requirements is the latest version. Don't forget guys, this mod does not work on free version GTA V, so make sure that your game version is 1.46. So guys, let's get straight into it. Now, all you guys got to do to install this mod, okay, is make sure you download the mod from the website and go to your Grand Theft Auto V game, hover over it, right click and open file location. This will bring you to the Grand Theft Auto V main folder. Head to your scripts folder and then now uh, inside your scripts folder, make sure that you got the latest native you. And inside your scripts folder, make sure you have the latest native UI.dll file, version 1.9 or 1.9.1. .1. If you got the latest native UI.dll file inside your, your scripts folder, then all you guys gotta do next is open up your gun run business extract folder. And inside the extract folder, all you gotta do is copy everything in there and then paste it inside your scripts folder. Now, once you guys have completed that, we are going to be deleting a few files. So head to your text file over here, delete that. Head to your disablebusiness.ini folder, and then go down to your recommended folder, and then copy your disablebusiness.ini file, copy, and then go back to your scripts folder, and paste right here. Now go back to your disabled business.ini folder and delete that folder. And now we have completed that. Now, before we do anything, okay, if you want to change your location to your business to Polito Bay or Fort San Cudo or anywhere, all you guys gotta do is right click and edit with notepad. Now inside here, inside your gun running business, you can change the location to Polito Bay. Uh, Fort St. Kudo or wherever you want. All you got to do is just change this to false and then change this to true and then that's all you guys got to do and then now press save and then exit out of your INA file and then go back to your scripts folder go back to your Grand Theft Auto V folder and then right click refresh your folder then exit out of your grand or the v game folder then refresh your desktop and then i'll see you guys in the game welcome back guys and we're here with franklin we're going to go and teleport to uh fort zancudo that is where our location is and there it goes so let's go straight over there guys but before we do go over there um we need to go, go and teleport there so we're going to use menu to, to teleport there. Now we are in our location. All you guys got to do before you get in there, because if you get in there, you will fall down, down the map, okay? So press F4. Then go down to teleporting. Then go to other, t other teleports. Go down to other teleports. Then go down in the middle and it says enable MP maps. Your game will freeze, but your game will freeze for only about under 10 seconds. So here we go. Now, as you guys can see that your game is freezed. Just wait for a few seconds and there you go. And now we are done. But guys, there is a few glitches in there, so I'll show you, okay? Hover over the, uh, the yellow spot, press E and you will teleport inside the bunker. Uh, so guys, this is the glitch that I was talking about, okay? As you guys can see that there's no ground. I don't know why, but um, yeah, it needs to be fixed. 
um, yeah, it needs to be fixed really. So, so guys, what I have done, okay, to fix the solution is that I, I was standing over here and I press F4. Then I went to teleporting and then I went to other teleports. Then I went down to gun running business teleports. And then I went to bunker. And as you guys can see, I'm in a bunker right now and there's a ground there, see? There's floor on the ground now, so that is how you fix it guys, okay? So when you come inside the bunker, you just only go and press F4, go to teleporting, go to other teleports, and then go to gun running, your gun running teleporting, then go to bunker and then it's fixed, okay? Then now all you guys got to do is exit out of the bunker and now enter back in your bunker and now it's all finally fixed, see? It's finally fixed guys, so yeah. Now inside the bunker, okay, the gun running business, you got a uh, multiple things, okay? You can do like um, purchase your, expand your business, you can check your data of your business, you can update your, your business show payouts and this is how much you'll be getting every every week and uh, you can buy and sell the business it's totally up to you product option you can buy and sell um shipments missions uh co-op elimination missions uh yeah and extra missions in here i have already done one of these missions and it was pretty cool i like the missions now over here we've got uh, gun uh, option over here, gun locker, that's pretty cool. And over here we've got, I think it's over here, yeah over here we've got a few things in here. Uh, over here we've got uh, a money vault, uh, yeah so the vault works, this is a pretty good vault. And over here we've got the, what do you call it, the shooting range so if you guys want to play the shooting range you must have a gun on you okay and uh, you can cheat if you want to because it's totally up to you but I'm gonna leave it like that so once you guys are here the most important thing is to turn off the cops okay so press F8 go to play options go right on the bottom and never want to yep yeah. now go over here Hover over the yellow line, press E, and now all you guys gotta do is just aim and shoot. See? And just aim and shoot, and then now, yeah. But apparently, guys, I forgot to take, turn off my explosive bullets. I forgot to turn off, but I am cheating, so. <laughs> yeah, so you guys, um, it is best to not cheat, uh, because if you do cheat, then. Yeah, basically it ruins the fun of the game. But if you guys want to exit the game, just press E. And then there you go. And now that's all we have, I think. Yes, that's all we have in here. Yeah, that's all we have guys. So I hope you guys do enjoy that. Because this mod is available right now. But like always guys, make sure you download all of the requirements inside my description below. And make sure that you, you use the latest native UI.dll file. And make sure that you have the latest game version of 1.46. So with that I'll see you guys, I hope you guys do enjoy the video. If you guys did, please smash the like button and subscribe for more daily gaming content. And I'll see you guys on my next video. Thanks for watching. Peace, and I'm out.